Warning, this video may contain content that may not be suitable for children or anyone else that is easily offended. Strong language, graphic content, nudity, bad jokes, and a possible idiot, aka myself, may be featured in the following clip. Viewer discretion is advised. You're not responsible for any damage that you receive watching this video. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Zims, and welcome back to video. Today we're going to be reacting to Mr. Beast. I got hunted by the military. This video is by Officer Mr. Beast. So you guys have to rate your shoes. Subscribe box. Click on the link and watch the video's entirety because I'm going to be pausing and stopping and talking through the whole thing. I remember Mr. Beast from a while ago. I remember I used to watch Twitch a lot. I was on Twitch like everywhere. That's all I see. But oh my God, thank you Mr. Beast. This dude was dropping money all over the place, bro. If you was just a random person, you even had two viewers, bro. He was dropping money on you. He just did it because he could. That's one thing I really admire about him. He's just very creative. He always doesn't find a dull moment. He, he's always doing something. He figures out stuff to do. He just gives away money because he likes giving away. It doesn't even have to do with anything. He just likes doing it. And I, and, I, and I think I love that most about him. And me being in the military myself, I'm kind of curious to see how they're going to track him down because I suck at land nav. I'm not going to get on here and try to like, oh yeah, I'm good. I, I'm horrible at land nav. I think I almost got lost one time there and the drill sergeants have to come and get us. Like I was I was out there in the woods, bro. I was lost. But being under 31 kilo, which is military working dog handling, we don't have to really do any of that stuff. So I'm glad I don't have to do land nav as much. I think I've done it like maybe two or three times out of the four and some changed years that I've been in. Also, I heard this thing today. Somebody said, you can't save someone's life. You only delay in their death. And I thought about, it. I'm like, wow, that is true. That, that I could save you now, but you're going to die eventually. Anyway, I guess the thought is like, yeah, I saved you, but for how long? You know what I'm saying? Damn, that's crazy if you think about it. Think about that one. But for now, let's get it. Let's go! 4,100 right around the corner, baby. Copter is carrying a military squad, and it's gonna land right over there. If that squad successfully hunts me down before the end of the day, they get this 100 grand. Run, run, run! 100 get grand? It, it. Don't you go, bro, go. Oh, they're running after us. They are right on our tail. We gotta get out of here. I purposely put their car further away so I can get a head start. Get in the vehicle, let's go! Come on! So right now, he's not too far away. He's right on the other side of these yeah, trees, it looks like. All right, we gotta be quick. They gotta okay, be special forces. Hey, Chandler. Yeah. You know what to do. I got you. I've been waiting for this. So I've done this in the past where I ran away from a bounty hunter in the FBI, but I've never ran away from three different people. Oh, they blew the bridge. <laughs> they so uh, savage. I think Jimmy can get away now. We're like a mile down the road and I heard that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you might have to go another way. The quickest way out of that field is this bridge that we just blew up. So now they have to take the long way out and that should give me like a five to 10 minute head start. I rented an entire museum, have dozens of cars, giant military equipment, and so much other cool stuff. This is just the beginning. Yo, this is about He's to be wild. Up, back off like Northwest. This is where things get fun. As you see the Squid Game mask over there, we're in the what? right place. Who is this guy? Now we are in a warehouse full of Jeeps. Let's just say when they pull up, they're gonna be very confused. Do you I'm pretty sure, yeah, but I was about to say, he's about to have different people drive around in the same vehicle, bro. It's going to be super tough for them to kind of, like, distinguish which vehicle he's in. Unless there's, like, a certain feature that they can point out to see where he is, then, um... You know what to do when they get here? No. no. Just drive in a random direction. Uh -huh. Right now? No, when they get here. Oh. And now we patiently wait and monitor the security cam. It looks like he stopped at a building. What's the strategy? Wait, is that a knife? Yeah. Is this the spot, boys? Yes, yeah, spot. They got a whole ass Humvee too. Spotted the military squad on the security cameras. All the doors on this building are locked. Let's see if they break into the warehouse. I'm gonna stay out front just in case somebody decides to run out the front door. We're gonna check out the back side, see if there's a vehicle back here. So one of them is waiting at the front door and two of them are in the back. We're just gonna patiently wait. The yeah, they gotta be retired. In the building. They look yeah, a little bit older. Doors we can break out front here. All right, sounds good. We're gonna grab this to go break some windows. There's fresh tire tracks leading in as well. Jim's going to get the vehicle. I'm gonna go ahead and break in. All right, go. The building. It's time to go. The the I'm gonna hide under this blanket so they can't see me in this car. Go, 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 go. Okay, let's roll back to the Hummer. Which one? Which one? Jimmy, they're right there. Do they notice me? No. Drive right past them, Jimmy. We made it out with all the other Jeeps, oh my gosh. Dude, they didn't even know how to react. Uh, he's on the move again. He's straight ahead, due south. This is the tracker that is telling the military squad where I am at all times. And if I put the tracker inside of this special bag, it jams it. And now they don't know where I am. It looks like, it looks like the, 
vehicle may have stopped. I don't see Jimmy. I think he's messing with us. All right, so hold on. It just updated. He's straight north again. Woohoo! <laughs> And now we're in the middle of nowhere. There's literally nothing out here, except this old barn that I had constructed. Whoa. Mind if I set my 100 grand right here? Bad news. There's only two seats inside of here. Ugh. That's crazy. I think I see them. Coming up on the tracker. Holy cow, here they come. All right, check the car. Let's check the car. Go, 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 go. Hey, 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 look, look, there he is, there he is. Brace yourself. <laughs> get in, get in. OK. Let's go. <laughs> Can you imagine how much fun this? I don't even care about like that. Just imagine how much fun this is. Just to just build something, just to be able to like break it and have fun with your friends and stuff. Like, man, dang, that's crazy. Hey guys, guys. Hey, I'd like to join your guys' team. What do you think? Yeah. You think? <laughs> oh, savage. Save Jimmy some time. Hopefully that's enough. Yeah, they go, gotta turn go, around. Go, go, go. All right, boys, here we go. Let's go. Is this as quick as she goes? There he is. There he is. We're coming for you, Jimmy. Oh, my God. They're catching up. Oh. Oh. New homies get up, bro. They fast. This is scary, man. We're coming up on the rocks. <laughs> you. According to our calculations, their car shouldn't be able to go over these rocks. All right. No, no, they go, got. Go, go, go. They, go. they probably can. They might have to slow down. Uh. <laughs> Later, nice. Let's go. Yeah, we can. Yeah, let's hit it. Let's say you can. You gotta do it slowly. Go, dude. Oh no! Oh, oh. Yeah. There. there we go. Boys, let's go. Wait. I remember the first. I remember the first time we had Humvees and it, it was like a Humvee course that we were able to go through and we were driving it and it was like a thing of water and I was just like, I was nervous. It took me, I took the longest. I was like, are you sure it's gonna be able to go across it? I was like, yes, trust me, it's gonna go. And that's, it went across the water, went over the rocks and all that. I was just like, man, how something so heavy can do so many things. Like even to this day, I still like, you just look at airplanes, you're just like, how is this big heavy ass thing able to fly? Like technology has come so far, it's like, it, it's crazy, bro. And the capabilities that the military have is like crazy. All the machinery and stuff and getting on helicopters it's ridiculous like if anybody in the military service they'll tell you like it's insane to see what some of these things can do and this is just some of the stuff that i've seen it's some of the stuff i haven't seen i can only imagine i don't think he thought we were gonna do that oh no i'm screwed the plan was to get in those quarter bodies but since the rocks didn't work Sorry about that, my battery was done. Future of banking and helps you manage all your money straight from your phone. The first 100,000 people that sign up and use code Beast Hunt will receive $1 for free. We're also <laughs> gonna give $500 to 100 random people that switch their paychecks over to Current. Not only does Current make banking easy, but signing up is very easy. It takes less than two minutes, and we've got $150,000 worth of prizes here. Click on your description and download Current right now. Do it. Thank you, Current. Hopefully, I don't lose 100 grand. All right, we've got a proposition. You double the money to 200K, we'll give you 10 minutes from right now. What about 150? 150, deal. Pull over, Jim. Can we get a Reese's <laughs> peanut butter cup lizard? Do you know who Mr. Beast is? Yeah, I do. We're actually chasing him right now, so we're gonna need these pretty quick. We just gave Jimmy a 10 minute head start. We already decided we're gonna donate the money anyway. We know we can help out a lot of people with it. And while the military got ice cream, mm -hmm. we buried Nolan alive so that they would think he was me. Nolan, yeah. are you ready? I'm about to drop my tracker down. I dropped it. Did you get it? No. Good, because I didn't drop it, but I just did. Ah. Ow, my face. Act like you're me. I'm going to go hide. Me and Chris are hiding in the woods. Let's see what happens. Oh, wow. He's playing the old switcheroonie. 150 grand because of your hiccups. I'm gonna kill I can't help it. I can't get rid of it. Can you just go walk down and see if you find him? Yeah, sure. It's very dark and spooky out here. A couple of... Oh. You guys aren't very good at being military people. Oh, God, don't tackle me. <laughs> <laughs> I just Jimmy, they got me. Did you see that video where I buried myself alive? We've done a lot of reconnaissance on you, my friend. I can tell. This whole video, you've been screwing up all my plans. It's annoying. I'm currently buried alive. 
Good luck. I hung up on him. That was a complete lie. Let's see if they fall for it. So right now he's still supposed to be buried in here, so we'll see. Hello? Carl, they're almost here. Go investigate. Report back. Okay. Hurry. These guys are good. I'm terrified. Hello? Who was it? Who are was these it? my marine friends that are right in front Marines. of my car? Marines? Is it a Hummer? Wait, Carl, who that is That are right in front of my car? Carl, is it them? Hey, what's up? Carl, is it them? Carl, is it them? Carl. Wait, hey, wait, before you go, wait, 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 wait. Oh, you're driving away right now and he's driving through the path right now? They blocked off our exit route. I have no idea where they are. I'm just laying in the woods. They're Jimmy, smart. Yeah. earlier today, before we jumped on the helicopter, who'd you talk to? I don't remember. That was a long time ago. Was it FaceTime or phone call? FaceTime. Er, not him. You could have been like, I don't remember. I'm Jimmy. I'm famous. I uh, have the tracker. You can't find Jimmy without me. Fair enough. You literally have to dig me up. You guys have to dig up Nolan, of all people. Hello? Let me know if he comes down this path. He's passing my car right now. He's got to go somewhere. They put this dude underground and stuck that big ass tube in there so he could, that's crazy, bro. The amount of, I want to know, I want to know how many people goes into like making all of these stuff. Yeah, I think you have to have the, like a demolition team. You got to have like a medical thing on standby. You have the camera crew, then you have your friends, and then you have all this other time. You got to pay people for time being there. Like I wish there was like a video to show you like how much going into making this 11 video 11 minute video because you got to understand this probably didn't take no 11. i'm pretty sure it probably took maybe a day or two maybe even a couple of weeks like i don't know it's kind of curious of like how it's made more than like the product a lot of people are like oh damn this video was cool but I don't really think about what it all it took to make this video or how much it cost to make a video like this yeah, yeah, yeah. he literally just walked right past me oh my gosh just move it that way i can't believe he literally walked past me i was laying down on the side of the path you come to me right now, we're fine. I move their Humvee so it's not blocking us anymore. So the coast is clear, Carl? Yes. Okay, I'm coming, I'm trusting you. Okay. Uh, I don't actually know if it is. Okay, okay, I'm close enough. Oh my God, just get us out of here. Go, go, go. Oh my God, I can't believe we got away. We're currently driving to the final location. I literally rented an entire museum, two hours until midnight. $150,000 on the line. Let's do this. Woo. Rented a museum. I know, like, That's you know, I know you can do that. Breaking the glass. Oh, don't, no, seriously, I'll <laughs> If you tell me the information that we need to know to keep moving, I'll get the bobcat and we'll dig you out 100 times faster than Jim and I can dig you out with shovels. Deal? Deal. The North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences. I'm just letting you know. <laughs> He's they're living. They're not getting the backhoe. They're leaving. No. All right, we'll see you later, Nolan. Bye. Chris. And now we are finally at the museum. Vanessa. Let's spend a night here. There's literally multiple different floors to this museum and I could hide anywhere I want. Now I'm gonna sit in this corner right here and I'm gonna cover up my back with this jacket. <laughs> now I'm hidden below this makeshift rock. Cut the lights. Oh, mm. I'm gonna go meet with them and try to get them to go other directions. Okay, have fun. Right. I mean, that's exactly an hour left to find Mr. Beast. I think that's more obvious. You guys are calling. Hello. Hello. I promise you I will not leave this museum. I am in here right. somewhere. Goodbye. Why is it so much fun to hang up on people? Hi guys. Hey. <laughs> what are you guys looking for? Ignore him, he's the enemy. I check the theater. Right. I'd check the theater. Yeah, he's not allowed in there. <laughs> yes, he's probably this way. Ah, uh, nope, that means no. Jimmy, come out. I told you that was obvious. Do you know where Jimmy is? Yes, I do, and of course I'll tell you. Okay, where is he? Oh, <laughs> Jimmy. All right, nothing. Uh, did you by chance go across any bridges? Lots of bridges, especially the bridge I blew up at the start of the video. Oh. oh. <laughs> See, the whispers would have gave it away because the whispers like, why are you whispering? So that lets me know I'm either getting close or you're somewhere where you're not supposed to be. Because that's the only way. Like earlier, you were like talking like loud, but now you're whispering. That means I'm in the right spot. 45 minutes. Jimmy. Split up. Even though I don't like splitting up, but. Oh, no. Wait, really? He's taking a picture for 
All right, get this stupid rock off my head. You guys just won 150 grand. What are you going to spend it on? Donated. We're going to donate it to the Hunter 7 Foundation. The Hunter 7 Foundation does research on toxic exposures for veterans from the last couple wars. By the way, your friend Nolan, uh, he's still in the ground. Boy, that was fun to watch. Like, it was cool to watch. They was donating that money. Like, that's hard. Donate all that money for research for veterans that was uh, exposed to toxic and chemical. That's true. I remember back then, they used to sit there and watch the atomic bombs go off and the radiation would come floating back. And some people got, like, sick and died and all that stuff. I remember that. I used to watch the videos on stuff like that. But, man, if you guys enjoyed, man, make sure you go by and show some love to Mr. Beast. His uh, link is going to be down in the description. If you guys are new to the channel, my name is Prof. Zims. And welcome to the Crow's Nest. Usually I react to more of a horror style, but a lot of people want to see me react to other things and see how that turns out. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know down in the comment section if you kind of like this or you want me to rather stick to like top 10 twisted things or murders or st scary stories. Let me know. I'm here for you guys. Um, if I don't like the video, I probably won't react to it. But at the end of the day, I like you guys to be included in what I do. So um, yeah, let me know down in the comment section what you think. But again, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Ah, ah.